Hi dear students, welcome to a new session of Color Cube. Today, let us have a discussion on the exercise part of Chapter 1, Living and Non-Living Things. Section A, answer these questions. In that, first question is, list the differences between living things and non-living things. Here, five, six differences are given here. First one, living things need air to breathe, but non-living things do not breathe. Living things move, non-living things do not move. Third one, living things need food to live. Non-living things do not need food. Living things grow, but non-living things do not grow. Living things have emotions. Non-living things do not have emotions. The sixth one, living things reproduce. Non-living things do not reproduce. Question number two, what are man-made things? Non-living things such as trains, cars, pencils, clothes, notebooks are made by man. They are called man-made things. Question three, name some natural non-living things. Hills, rivers, lakes, ponds, clouds, sun, moon are natural non-living things. Question 4. Do non-living things reproduce? No, non-living things do not reproduce. Question 5. How do fish breathe? Fishes breathe through their gills. Section B, write true or false. In that, first question is, plants and animals are examples of non-living things. False. Second question, some non-living things are given to us by nature. True. Third question, non-living things do not breathe. True. Fourth one, living things do not need food to grow. This is false. Fifth one, non-living things can reproduce. Answer is false. Next one is, section C, fill in the blanks. In the first question is, non-living things do not feel and do not have dash, do not have emotions. Second question is, those things created by man is called dash. Those things created by man is called a man-made things. Dash grow from saplings. Plants grow from saplings. Fourth one is, plants breathe through holes in their dash. Plants breathe through holes in their leaves. Fifth one, dash is the process of producing younger ones. Reproduction is the process of producing younger ones. Thank you.